joining me today. I have a Sephora haul. I know it looks like a little bit, but I shoved everything into this little bag so I could show you guys on camera. No, joking. <laughs> so I just have a couple of things that I purchased. They had a lot of really good um, point perks this month and stuff. And it's weird. And then some just, you know, rewards and that. So I just utilized that. So I'm just going to go through the bag and go through the stuff that I got and tell you guys about them. First thing I got was the Beauty Blender and I mostly got it because I really liked this little stand that it has. So I used that today, that's why it's all dirty, but yeah, that was the first thing. Um, one of the perks or what is it, rewards, beauty deals or whatever that you get when you order something, I got one of these. Actually, this was a 100 point perk. Yeah, this was the 100 point perk. And this is the First Aid Beauty Face Cleanser. And it's just um, one ounce, so it's really nice travel size. Um, really nice um, size for that. Uh, one of the samples I got was the Foundation Primer Laura Mercier one. Let's see if I can get these samples out first. The Bumble and Bumble Thickening Shampoo and Conditioner Sample. And then the Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue Tinted Hydration Gel Cream. And this comes with four samples of different colors. And the Algonist Ultimate Anti-Aging Eye Cream. And it's just a little foil packet. And I know that there's more samples in here. The Nirvana and James Black Perfume. And the Philosophy Purity Made Simple 3-1 Cleanser. I really want to try this. I have it, I have like a little basket over here on my vanity. And it just has some things that I want to try the samples of before I buy. And I ha that's one of the ones that I put in there. So, yeah, kind of really liked that. And I got the um, Dior Nude Air, Dior Skin Nude Air. And this one's in medium beige, which I think this one's going to be too dark for me. But um, just that sample. One of the free perks, one of the beauty deals that I got was this um, First Aid Beauty Deep Cleanser in Skin Rescue with red clay. And I really like the First Aid Beauty products. And I also got an Origins Checks and Balances Frothy Wash. This is one of my favorite face cleansers. So I picked that up. Sorry, I had to look outside for a second. Um, oh, I got another sample here, and that's the Ole Hendrickson Pure Truth Youth Activating Oil. A 100 point perk that I got was the Clinique Super Primer Universal Face Primer Super Base, and I haven't tried this before, but it's just a primer from Clinique. Well, the interesting Clinique has really nice products for sensitive skin and stuff, so that's good. Another 100 point perk I got was this little Marc Jacobs um, lip cream and it's in Kiss Kiss Bang Bang and it's kind of like um, a Marsala color so it's really nice and that was 100 points and then I cashed in 500 points, I had so many points, I had like 2500 points in that so um, and I got the Formula X set. So it's just a little four mil of the Formula X top coat of the Formula X nail cleaner of a nail polish in Impeccable and of the base coat. And I love this base coat. If you watch my channel, you know I'm in love with that base coat. And then I also got the Sephora Instant Nail Polish Remover Wipes. And these are my favorite nail polish remover wipes. I use this and then I go in with the Josie Marin Bare Naked Wipes. And that's how I take off my nail polish and I love it. My favorite thing to do. I don't even use the um, like bottle nail polish remover anymore. I just use these. These are so amazing. I keep them in my purse. I just take them anywhere with me and I love it. I picked up a YSL Tinting Oil, and this is in the shade Undress Me number 3. 
and I've been using this for about a week and a half. It's not going to show up on my skin because it's the lightest shade. But I debated whether or not to take this back. And I kind of like it as a gloss and as a hydrator. So I'm not going to take it back. I think I'm just going to get more colors. This smells so amazing. I can't even describe it. It's so... I don't know how many years. It's like a fruity smell almost. And it's just such a nice sleek packaging. I love this product so much. Um amazing if it's it was $35 but that's about how much a high-end lip is lippy is and um, it's YSL very good quality love it I have nothing but good things to say about this this is such an amazing product I think I'm gonna get a couple more in the darker shades and this one here just because it doesn't show up on me doesn't mean that it's not gonna show up on you it kind of picks up on your natural um, lip colors and pigments and stuff and then it activates as your as it stays on longer so and that but yeah I love it as a gloss and then I picked up the Naked Basics 2 palette from Urban Decay I've used this one once I'm not sure if I'm liking this one but I wanted something that was matte shades just neutral matte shades that I could do like transition colors with because I find that I don't have any good transition colors so and they're really chalky I don't know I kind of just wanted something that was nice nudes and stuff like that that I could just use to do the crease to do a little smoked out eye just something that if I wanted something basic just to throw in my purse and I really liked the Naked Basics 2 palette better than the one. I might even get the first one. I'm not sure but so I picked that up. I also ended up doing an order from Smashbox and I'm wearing the eyeshadow that I got from Smashbox today and it is the Blue Eyes Photo Opt Eye Enhancing Palette and it's just a really cute palette. It um, looks like this so it's very sleek and Obviously, it's like the other Smashbox ones where you can check out different looks and that. And then when you open it up, I am I really can't stand it when they have these like inserts on them of the colors. But it just comes like that with a brush and then it's got mattes and shimmers. So, let me see. These are really chalky, I find, but I really like them as in there's, you can kind of do different things with it. You can kind of do, use a shimmer and then use a matte or just use mattes or just use shimmers, kind of do different things. And they're really nice colors for obviously blue eyes because it's a blue eye one. But yeah, I'm really happy with this purchase. Even though they are a little bit flaky, I kind of like them. So that was kind of nice and it's so tiny and compact and it comes with a brush and a really nice size mirror so you can take it on the go you can throw it in your purse and so on and that and with that I got some free samples as well I got the Smashbox photo finish primer foundation primer I got a tiny tiny BB cream in light medium and then I got this tiny Smashbox um, lip gloss in coral and it's just so cute and it's really creamy and pigmented so that'll be nice for the summer and that so that was all I got from uh, Sephora and Smashbox kind of just not that exciting but some things that I really wanted to um, pick up just some basic stuff as well and some things that I wanted to try so it's not that exciting but hey, it's Sephora, and who doesn't like shopping at Sephora? I love it. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this haul, and I hope it gave you some ideas of some things if you wanted to try them, and that, yeah. Anyway, I hope you guys have a beautiful day, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.